For a second day in a row, firefighters were at the Coshocton Grain Company. A fire reignited in the bins there as investigators were on the scene trying to determine what caused an explosion yesterday. ABC6 reporter Luann Stoya has a report from Coshocton. You can see steam coming out of it. See the smoke. While investigators looked through the rubble to find the cause of the explosion, another fire reignited in the silos. The fire chief tells us corn is still smoldering. I can't be 100% sure that we're not going to have another one, but I don't think if we do, it's going to be anything as catastrophic as what we had last night. Nearby businesses and a daycare were on edge after being evacuated on Wednesday, but authorities kept a close watch on the still burning structure. Safety's the top priority for Carla Dawson, who had to explain to the kids what was going on. They they heard the noise and of course, you know, some of our preschoolers came up with all kinds of stories. One of our friends said a dinosaur did it. Seven men were injured in the blast. All are recovering after being released from the hospital. We're doing a lot of praying for the employees over there and and just getting through the situation. That is our concern and to keep lifting them up in prayer. The company released this statement saying they're grateful for the community support and they say they will cooperate with officials to determine the cause of the accident here. In Coshocton, Lou Ann Stoya, ABC 6 News.